hello everyone welcome to dc minds and if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and in this video we will see another operator called logical operator so what is logical operator so basically logical operators are used to combine two or more condition in my previous video we saw what is relation operator that is how to form condition using relation operator so basically logical operators if you want to combine two or more conditions suppose we have a situation like uh, you you have to you, there is a uh, form you need to fill and that form you only the person of age between 20 to 30 they can fill if the person is uh, less than 20 they cannot fill if the person is greater than 30 they can so between 20 and 30 the person can be uh, fill the form so in this case we need to check two condition first if the age of the person is greater than equal to 20 and another condition will be the person age is less than or equal to 30 so now these two condition has to be checked together and if both condition are true then only the form filling operation can be done by that person so here the, the, that two that two condition has to be combined so for that purpose we have uh, a operator called logical operators so combining two or more condition so we have three types of logical operators one is called logical and so logical and means when you combine two or more condition at that time all those condition has to be true it, then it returns true see if all those condition are true then it will return true otherwise it will return false if any of those condition are false then it will return false suppose just take an example we have a variable a equal to 5 and we want to check if the this variable a this value is between um, 0 and 10 so in this case if we see a is greater than 0 yes 5 is greater than 0 this condition became true and then and that means uh, combining these two condition and then a is less than 10 yes this is this a is 5 is less than 10 so in this case this both this both condition are true so what will happen this will this whole combined result will be true but in this case we are checking the whether the number is between 0 and 4 so here a is greater than 0 yes 5 is greater than 0 yes this is true but here a is 5 so here 5 is less than 4 no it is false so this became true and this became false so in this case only one of them are true so this will become it will return uh, false both has to be true in this case of logical operator means whatever the operators uh, means in case of logical operator whatever the condition we are combining all the condition has to be true let's see another uh, operator logical operator called um, logic or so in this case this is denoted by double pipe so it will return true or false and in this case what will happen if we combine two or more uh, conditions so if one of them one of the condition are true then it will return true if all the condition are false then it will return false so let's see an example so here a is 5 so in this case we are checking this whether the number is between uh, 0 and 5 so if a is greater than 5 5 yes it is true 5 is greater than 0 and uh, here also 5 is less than 10 yes it is true so here in this case both are true so it will return true and in this case if we see uh, a is greater than 0 yes 5 is greater than 0 yes so this this case is true and this case 5 is less than um, 4 no so this is case this condition is false and this condition true so uh, as per the definition of logical or if one of the condition are false true then it is true so this condition is true in this case so this will return true now we are checking whether the number is greater than 6 and less than 4 so in this case 5 is greater than 
5 is greater than 6? No, this is false. And 5 is less than 4? No, false. So in this case, this fourth condition are false. So in this case, it returns false. So for loop, uh, sorry, logical or if one of the condition is true, then it will return true or otherwise it will return false. Let's see another um, operator called logical not. So in this case, we have a also a return value as true or false. So basically in this case, what will happen if the result is result is uh, uh, tr true, then it will become false. And if the result is false, then it will become true. So, so in this case, what will happen? A is equal to five. So if we use not A means this is how it is used. Not logical, not A means it will return false because A is five and this, there is some value. So that will turn into false. But B int B, B equal to zero. And this is little different from these two operators. And if he means B equal to zero, so what will happen? This zero is nothing but false. This, this false will become turn into true. So basically it will invert the result. So true will become false and false will become true. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and check out my other video for watching some other concept.